hey, what we're going to do is we are going to write the equation of a line given a y-intercept and a slope. And as I always say, be good, take some notes, because staring at me is not going to help you learn. All right. Math with Miss B. Math with Miss B. There's a thousand other places that you'd rather be. But you're watching math with Ms. B. Plug the slope in as M. Plug the y in as B. If I have a slope of 2 and a y-intercept of 0, negative 4, I take the 2, I plug it in for M. I take the negative 4 and I plug it in for B. And that's my answer. <laughs> I know, you're like... That's way too easy, but it's, that's, yep. Okay, so let's say example number two, m equals negative eight, um, y-intercept equals zero comma 12. What do I do? y equals negative eight x plus 12. Yep, that easy. m equals eight, y-intercept is zero comma negative 29. y equals eight x minus 29. Yes, I know, I know, I know. It's like one of the easiest lessons, right? <laughs> um, M equals one half, not a fraction. And Y intercept is zero comma negative five. Yes, yeah, a fraction, but same rules apply. Instead of M, put the fraction there. Um, instead of B, put the negative five there. Y equals one half X minus five. Don't put plus minus five, don't do that. Just put minus five. M equals negative one third, and your y-intercept is zero comma negative four. Same rules. Negative one third x minus four. You should do the rest of these on your own. Yeah. Two fractions. Oh my gosh! But are the rules changing? They show ain't. Y equals three halves x minus one half. Yes, that's what we like. M equals one. Y intercept zero comma zero. Ooh, what is this gonna look like? Y equals x. Miss Bernard, where'd all the numbers go? Well, if m is one, that means in front of the x is a one. When one is the coefficient, do I write it? No, nah, we big kids. And then plus B, plus zero. What's the point of writing a plus zero? Plus nothing? For what? what we, for what? You did this for what? Y equals X. That's the way we like it. You got this. y equals x plus two-thirds. Looks funny, but that's correct. Remember, when m is one, that means the coefficient of x is one. I don't write coefficients of one, because we grown. Plus two-thirds. A. Okay. What if the slope is zero and the y-intercept is zero? Guess what, a zero, so m, if m is zero, so that means zero times x. What's zero times x? It's zero. So am I gonna write it? Nah, dog. Y equals five. It's a horizontal line. You, mm, should you know about those already? You probably should, I think. <laughs> and that's it, in a nutshell. Yeah, you! You! Mm, mm, mm. Sorry, okay. <laughs> that's it, really quick, really easy, in a nutshell, with special cases. Go back to the video, see if you can do them on your own. Make sure you're taking some notes. Share, like, subscribe, comment, all the things. And I'll see you in the next.